Howdy folks, for today's video we are going to just do a little unboxing video and take a first look at the Feiyachi Green Laser Flashlight Combo. And I picked this up from Amazon. I was looking for kind of an inexpensive green laser and flashlight. Of course, made in China, but I think most things are made in China nowadays. But, yeah, I was looking for something not not like crazy serious, like this is going to be my self-defense and I'm going to go, you know, clearing houses and stuff. But it's just, uh, I just kind of wanted one, a green laser flashlight combo and uh, not spend too much. And I also wanted to just uh, throw it on a couple guns and, and do some non-serious night shooting. I've been uh, night shooting before and it was really fun. We were uh, using a green laser. And we use that as kind of like our flashlight to illuminate some milk jugs. So we would actually uh, have the, the spotter guy. He would turn on the green laser and uh, <laughs> target the milk jug. And the whole milk jug would glow green. And it was just, it was so much fun. And it was just awesome because, you know, the spotter guy, he could just light, illuminate something. And then we were shooting some supersonic 300 blackouts with a... A vortex illuminated scope or like a, a scope with an illuminated reticle and so you could actually go and we were just you know transitioning shooting from target to target and it was just tons of fun and so I just wanted something to you know play around with and do some night shooting and uh, you know and also put it through the paces and see if it's uh, you know worth throwing on, you know, a self-defense rifle or something. So yeah, uh, let's go ahead and do, uh, let's open this up, take a look at it, and then maybe compare it to my old, <laughs> it's my old Streamlight TLR2, which is a red laser and flashlight combo. And uh, I've really enjoyed this thing over the years, but I will say red lasers are not very visible during the day. So if you want to use it, you know, in the day or if you're trying to like sight it in during the day, it's like kind of tough because red lasers just aren't as visible as the green lasers. The green lasers you can actually see at night and during the day. Like at night they're so bright that you can almost it like you can almost see the beam of the green because of the uh you know, bouncing off the dust particles and stuff. It's it's really pretty impressive uh, some of the green laser stuff so technology so all right let's go ahead and uh, open this up and take a look at it all right so here we go here we have the let's see does it have a model number Feiyachi LF 58 green pistol handgun rifle all right so yeah let's check it out little desiccant packet not gum, <laughs> not chiclets. All right. So LF58, very basic instructions. Got your Now, for something being made in China, it actually feels, you know, feels decently uh good. You know, a lot of times you can pick up a uh, stuff from made in China and it's just, you could tell it's total junk. And, you know, this has a little bit of beveling on the edges and not sharp edges. And it looks like it comes with um, two CR123s batteries. And... Looks like two Allen wrenches. So it looks like two Allen wrenches. So with the two Allen wrenches, I would guess that, uh, you know, the smaller one is to adjust the, the laser to sight it in. Uh, let's see, not really sure what the, the bigger one is for. But the clip to open it up. Right, oh! It has a, an extra set of batteries ready to go, so that's kind of cool. There's a little lip right there to pop it in and then 
push that clip down. Okay, so it looks like you have uh, your settings right here. So with this dial right here, you can choose to have just the green laser or straight down gives you just the flashlight and then all the way to the left gives you oh straight down is both and then all the way to the left my my finger was actually covering up the the laser um, below so straight down is both the green laser and the flashlight then to the left is just the flashlight so just the flashlight green laser and flashlight and then green laser so um, we should take this outside or maybe look at it inside the house but uh, see how bright that green laser is so you you got your activator switch right here and that's on and if you wanted to you know temporarily turn it on you could do that activate it so let's see how it kind of compares to the streamlight so the streamlight has almost like a not like a unibody but like you can see it's a one piece all the way around right here you can see the laser section is a separate piece and held in by a couple allen keys on this one you can see that it is uh, so the body all of even though there's like this line right here there's a whole kind of the the body is one piece but this part slides in and out I doubt that this is like waterproof or anything but uh, yeah it's kind of kind of interesting it feels feels you know decently good the clip the retaining clip is uh, actually pretty similar and uh, looks like on the streamlight you have you know the the spring and the one screw to go across to lock it down onto your rail with this one you have oh that's what the the larger allen key is for or allen wrench right there and right there and that's to uh, to lock it onto the rail of your handgun or your rifle so yeah let's uh let's go outside and or let's look down the hallway first and then we'll take it outside and and just see and uh, see kind of some differences I know I'm not comparing apples to apples because I have a you know this is really old and it's a red laser and this is new and it's a green laser but I just thought it'd be kind of a cool comparison to see you know something that costs a lot of money and something that costs a lot less so let's take a look Okay, so now we're just upstairs looking down the hallway, and I'll just show you real quick. This is what the the streamlight looks like. You know, the in this type of uh, lighting conditions, you can see it looks the red laser looks great. You know, and then the new. Let's see. I'll leave that on. Sorry about the shakiness. And we'll turn that to just the laser. So, got a little bit of Christmas action going on with the green and red. You can, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but the green is like way brighter. So, kind of, kind of cool. Let's uh, go outside and see if we can see a difference in the sunlight. All right, so we're here in the backyard just looking at these two different lasers and comparing green and red and the TLR2 and the Feiyachi green laser. So let's go ahead and turn on the 
red one and we're gonna shine it on that fence back there and the red one gets lost before I can even see it I can see it on the grass about halfway and then it just disappears so not visible like at all in the day and we're gonna go ahead and take that green laser so just to the left of the middle you can see it on the fence so even in the sun on a white fence or cream colored fence I can see that green laser whereas the red laser gets lost so that's that's pretty good in the nighttime this thing should be going like crazy so cool all right guys so you know for 50 bucks on Amazon I think it's the LF 58 Feiyachi LF 58 flashlight green laser combo you know it's it's actually not a bad price for something like that you know for, for what I'm using it for so I think it has five star review on Amazon you know pretty decent and the build quality feels decent they give you two sets of batteries and you know I'm pretty pretty happy with this this little thing I will uh, if I have any problems with it then I will go ahead and do like a, a video update on it you know let you know what failed or what I had issues with but uh, you know until then you know not bad for $50 green laser and flashlight combo so LF 58 made by Feiyachi and I think you can get it on Amazon so so anyways if you guys have any questions or comments about this one or if you have a if you've used it and you you know like it or hate it let me know and also if you've used something else that's you know comparable price then uh, let me know it's I'm I'm always curious about you know gun products and uh, you know things that have worked and things that haven't so until next time stay safe have fun catch you later <laughs>